Hey guys, welcome back to my video and today I'm going to be showing you insects that are not dangerous but you think they are. Now, the first insect, arachnid, is spider. Spiders? Oh yeah. Now, spiders are pretty scary for some people who have arachnophobia. You probably should know that. But, the way to overcome this sickness or a phobia is to face to face with your enemy the spider anyway now the way that this works is you see a spider it looks super creepy it's super hairy and then you just you are afraid forever so be careful yeah so, be careful. I already said that. So guys, the next um, thing, our uh, insect is... Millipedes. Millipedes look scary for some reason. But they're actually not scary that much. And the true thing about millipedes, the only thing that they can attack is dry leaves in the ground. Yeah. Because they eat dry leaves in the ground. Well, not actually in the ground, but from anywhere. So yeah, millipedes look scary. They're not. The thing goes. Arthropod phobia. And then this just happens over again. Don't be scared. There's nothing to be scared of. You just, if you see one, eh... Uh, you just leave it alone, um, you know, take it out, uh, take it outside and release it in Mother Nature. Now, the next thing that I'm going to be showing you is a big giant centipede. <laughs> Centipedes are super, super creepy, scary, bleepy, but they are. So... They are, and they're bad too. Their bite is, I mean, enough. pierce your skin. So, don't worry. If you see one, let it do a thing. Because centipedes are actually helping you, then you are helping them. Only thing you are helping them is to squish them in their legs. But yeah. Don't kill centipedes because they are actually doing a favor for you. Bed bugs, mosquitoes, cockroaches. Yeah, they're eating them for you. They're getting rid of the pests that you don't want in your house. So you don't have to be scared of them, especially the house centipede. You can even keep the one as a pet. As you can do with all of them. Yeah, you can keep them as pets too. But if you just, you know, have know how to treat them properly and blah, blah, blah. Now, the next thing you can do to keep your house away from insects that you don't want is... Lemons and cucumbers. I don't know why. You just... You know, take the mm, put cucumbers everywhere and, you know, no more ants, mm, no more bed bugs. Okay, I'm just kidding, bed bugs will still come, but no more, no more flies, no more of those. If you want, but if you use cucumbers, the same thing is going to happen, but be careful because cockroaches are actually... Not allergic, they actually love cucumber. So just be careful. The next one is like this is like the fourth one is cockroaches. Okay, I know I told to get rid of cockroaches. I usually show the spit germs everywhere in the world. In the world. But they already, you know, they are quite harmless. Unless, you know, somebody really 
did that. Anyway, actually quite harmless, but still they spread germs, so still be careful. But this you just you just be scared and don't squish it and just you know throw it outside with a broom or with a with a piece of paper or anything. Yeah. So the next animal that is on my list is ants. You don't have to be scared of ants. Just don't disturb them. Don't disturb any of them because they do really, um, they do sting. The, especially the uh, Asian bullet ants, they sting crazy and it's like being shot by a bullet. So yeah, just be careful and yeah. So guys, that's it for this video. Uh, thanks for watching and bye. Oh, head down, 25 subs.